Green Bay Wacky. I do news, comedy skits, how-to videos, original music videos, and fun and interesting live streams. You gotta go to my playlist. Green Bay Wacky is on all social media platforms. Support me by subscribing, becoming a monthly member, go to my about page for merchandise, or simply share my videos. Hey, it's Green Bay Waggy. You know what? This story got my goat today. Um, you know, the Democrats, the hard wing left, um, you know, they talk about unifying our country and how we want to heal deep wounds. And, you know, everything you hear out of their mouth is uh, systemic racism and we're a racist country and we're bad and we're terrible. And here you've got a public figure, Lori Lightfoot, mayor. All right. This is in, I'm going to show you this right from Chicago's own uh, website. Um, check this out. I mean, this is like, seriously, like this is like a wow, bro, dude moment. Um, so Mayor Lightfoot defends granting interviews to only black and brown journalists. I'll explain the whole story in just a minute. Um, Mary, uh, Mayor Lori Lightfoot announced Tuesday that she would only grant one-on-one -on -one interviews to black and brown journalists. And she's defending this. I look at this. I'm thinking in the one day in this one day when we are looking at the two-year anniversary of my inauguration as a woman of color, as a lesbian, it's important to me that diversity is put front and center, Lightfoot said. So she's actually defending it. If this isn't blatant, in-your-face racism, call it reverse discrimination, I don't know what is. What did any other reporter do wrong to Mayor Lori Lightfoot um, other than, so now they're white, they're Latino, they're a different race, nationality. They don't get to talk to her, only reporters of color. You know, I would call BS on this. Um, is this a unifying message? Is this a bring us together message? What about her area there in Chicago? Um, you know, you think there's not a diverse mixture of uh, races? I mean, what kind of message does this send to the United States of America? What kind of message does it send to her home state of Illinois? What kind of message does it send to the neighborhoods of uh, Chicago? Um, you know what? Always, as always, blatant in your face from the left Democrats. And, uh, you know, it's okay for them. It's okay. Everything out of their mouth is systemic racism. We're a, you know, a racist country. But here's Mayor Lori Lightfoot right there in your face committing racism. And trying to justify it is it's okay and it's not. It's uh, no, it's not that. It's not that. I'm proud of this. I report it. You decide. I think this is pretty shameful. Uh, by the way, keep in mind, she's got a track record of other things. You know, I followed Lori Lightfoot for a little while. She's the one that, while she had everyone's butt locked down for COVID, she was out getting haircuts. And you know how she justified it? She went on camera because she got caught. She said she, as a public figure, had to look a certain way. She was, um, her hygiene was important to her. So while everyone else was locked down, she was out and about Gail vanting around, getting haircuts. Um, she's the one that got on the microphone right in the streets and has said that she'll arrest people for leaving their house, for breaking the COVID lockdowns while she was getting caught gallivanting around with no masks on and that kind of thing. Um, it's, it's typical Democrat. I am sorry. This is shameful. I report it. You decide. Tell me what you think in the comments. Um, I, I just think this is shameful for a public figure to actually come out and say that I am only going to do interviews with colored uh, reporters. Wow. I love my brothers and sisters of all nationalities. Lori Lightfoot, so should you. So should you. And you shouldn't penalize uh, any reporter out there based on the color of their skin. Shameful. Shame on you, Lori Lightfoot. Okay, I report it. You decide.